हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल आई एम अरमोहान एंड यू आर वाचिंग निंजा इराकी दिनार यूट्यूब चैनल होपफुली यू ऑल डूइंग वेल गॉड विल गिव यू मोर हैप्पीनेस फॉर यू ऑल आई ट्राई माय लेवल बेस्ट टू गिव यू ऑल लेटेस्ट अपडेट अबाउट इराकी दिनार सो गाइस लेट्स स्टार्ट टुडे द इंफॉर्मेशन द प्रोसेस ऑफ ड्रॉपिंग द जीरोस प्राइमरीली इन्वॉल्व्स एडजस्टिंग द एक्सचेंज रेट बाय मूविंग द डेसिमल पॉइंट 3 प्लेसेस which creates a need for new currency notes specifically lower denominations that will physically remove the zeros we anticipate a rate stronger than 1 1 based on sadani's assertion that the dinar will surpass the dollar in strength it's crucial that both the rate change and the introduction of the lower denominations occur simultaneously otherwise these smaller notes would be essentially useless without the corresponding rate adjustment while the change could technically begin at any moment possibly even through emails the conflicting reports circulating right now suggest that the timing will still catch many by surprise discernment and patience are necessary especially given recent news that an announcement regarding Iraq's accession to the World Trade Organization WTO will be made on the 18th this is a monumental event as preparations for a formal public celebration in the square are already underway signaling that Iraq is preparing to showcase its new global standing. Sadani seems keen to broadcast to the world that Iraq's membership in the WTO will be pivotal for its economic reform and the introduction of a floating currency will attract significant investment, manpower, and capital. It's important to note, however, that managing Iraq's currency exchange rate is not within the WTO scope. Their focus is on trade, not exchange rates. This week, there were reports of new currency being prepared, with confirmation that Iraq will not issue the long-rumored 20,000 dinar note. This can only mean that fresh, lower denomination notes are coming, signaling a return to older currency values and finally doing away with the larger 30 notes. As the Minister of Trade arrives in Geneva to lead negotiations for Iraq's accession to the WTO, There's growing anticipation. The slashing of the zeros on existing notes, such as the 50,000 dinar, is a sign of the transition, and the citizens are being educated on these changes. For those fluent in Arabic, the information is no longer a secret. The Central Bank of Iraq has confirmed that the project to delete zeros remains in place, meaning that notes currently valued at 1,000 dinars will be replaced by new notes worth 1 dinar. With meetings on crucial matters like the HCL, the WTO, and other reforms taking place in Iraq right now, this week promises to be a pivotal one. The economic landscape is changing, and the excitement is palpable as we all await the next steps.